what, we have some guests in the studio with us today. Mm -hmm. uh, Ian Locke here again with Jim Roback back in the studio. Um, VFW back with us again. Yes, we, we're again. with you guys. We're mm -hmm. with Chuck and Cindy. Cindy Wright uh, with us and uh, Chuck Haskins. So here we are talking about so many things happening mm -hmm. in town with you guys. You're so active in that organization. A great partner of ON TV and the things we you know help Good, help promote and work together. Mm -hmm. It's mm -hmm. a great, great, great uh, a team uh, effort between the two of us. And so you're here today to share some absolutely wonderful news about uh, different things that the VFW is up to. So take it away. What are we talking about first? We're going to say something just happened. Well, this past Friday, yeah. we had the um, introduction of our new additions to the Oregon Veterans Memorial mm -hmm. over on 24, and which was a great, great memorial before we put this in. Mm -hmm. But uh, we had Fabulous. an issue with our old Victory Garden okay. that uh, hit some wear and tear. So our good friends over at Home Depot turned around and came in, took out the old, and they built us a new one that should last us many, many years. Uh, it's basically made of stone. Very good. And, uh, but to include right next to the memorial or the Victory Garden, yeah. we have two new memorials. Well, there's room? Yeah, it was <laughs> tight fit. But there's, there's so many things there. So tell us mm -hmm. about the memorials. Yeah, it, it's, it's really interesting. It is recognizing for so long that, you know, we have all those memorials for yes. different parts there. What we're recognizing now is Rosie the River from World War II mm -hmm. and all the hard work that the women did to supply, you know, yeah. help with the... And we know the work, iconic yeah. imagery, mm -hmm. you know, <laughs> the uh, the hammer or the mm -hmm. wrench, and we know that. I mean, it so, is iconic. And the memorial goes and explains all that. Okay, great. So it's all there. Then the other one is another one we dearly should have had a long time ago, but it's for the women of the military. Mm. Uh, World War II was the start. Actually, I think it even started in World War One, but World War II was the first time women got engaged in the... And all the way up to the time is we have Cindy here, who was in the U.S. Air Force. Mm -hmm. And but this memorial is there to recognize all the women and what they do mm -hmm. for it. And it really works with the new Victory Garden. There. Yeah, and it's it's interesting that you have those. And uh, I mean, expanding the memorial, the the fabulous. Uh, uh, the layout of it, mm -hmm. like we, we talked before we were on mm -hmm. air, we had a little chit chat about mm -hmm. it, of how f really wonderful it is. It's one of the best in the oh, state of Michigan, yes, yes, if not yes. maybe the Midwest for yes. a community of our size. Mm -hmm. It's it's really fabulous, mm -hmm. and to have all the different branches represented mm -hmm. and the new additions. And I don't know, did you know there's a victory? I didn't know no, there's I a didn't victory know garden over there. I've been there so many times, never realized. Yeah, it. uh, who donated this? How did you come up with the funds to do this? Well, the major benefactor to us was uh, Home Depot. Mm. And Is that right? And made, made grants to do that. Then our post donated money also that go out and help do it. Was that, that for and the statues or what that were, were being put up there? Just the Victory Garden? For, for the materials. For materials the, the, the materials of the Victory Garden right. itself, Home Depot did the majority of that, and some local people also donated some money. Awesome. Uh, the memorials, we, for the... Um, um, Roses of the River, they had a group of people that got together and donated that. Then for the women in the military, our post donated that one. Awesome. Are they and plaques or actually images or something? They are plaques. Plaques, yeah, okay. Good sized plaques. And it okay. uh, looks very, very, very nice. That's, very awesome. nice. That's amazing. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. And Home Depot, we, we <laughs> have to say thank We can't mm -hmm. say thank oh. you enough. Yeah. They helped out with the platform right. and the covering. and. Mm -hmm. You know, for the uh, where we, all the presentations we are made. ask and they deliver. Mm -hmm. So that's, always, it's they're fabulous, fa fantastic partners. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, another item we just did with the memorial also was revealed on Friday, on the outskirts, uh, right over by the 24. We have new seven flagpoles, stainless steel, with each one of the branches of the services. No. Okay. So that is up there right now, and so uh, it looks. I was gonna say a new dynamic uh, look yeah. to it. Yeah. Wow! Yeah. I mean, it looked fabulous beforehand, yeah. but now you have that with the motion of the flags. Mm -hmm. It really mm -hmm. makes it dynamic. So to stand you out. mentioned we're, we represent all the branches of service. Mm -hmm. Well, we got flags for mm -hmm. all the branches of the services. Awesome. Even the new one, <laughs> Space Force. Oh, is that right? Yes. Oh, we got that there. No so. kidding. Yes. I don't think. Uh, have I seen? Have you seen no. the flag for Not that? Yet. I, I would uh, never yeah. have thought of that. But yeah. yes, that's the new. 
new branch mm -hmm. that has been launched a couple years ago, a couple years right? ago. Mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. uh, in its infancy, but uh, it's up, up and growing. Interesting. So, yes, we're getting big. But uh, if you ever watch Star Trek, <laughs> when, you, when you see that when you see that flag, <laughs> right. you, you immediately yeah. think of oh, Star kinda, Trek. Oh, kind of, it kind of echoes uh, that. Yeah, yeah. yes, that it does. Well, you have a familiar, mm -hmm. you know, color scheme and mm -hmm. um, imagery, so yeah. people can immediately recognize it. That's mm -hmm. awesome. So, so. Uh, yeah, so. There's more going on. Oh. I mean, we, we have a list we, here. Yeah, we've got a very important day coming up here yeah. in November. Absolutely. Yeah, <laughs> and it's Veterans Day. Yep. And there's programs going all over the state mm -hmm. of Michigan. And um, two I can think of right here, it can affect our area, is up Great Lakes National Cemetery yes. is having mm -hmm. a Veterans Day program. It's going to start at around noon okay. and go to about 2 o'clock. And that's a very solemn and never, nobody's ever been up to Great Lakes. Mm -hmm. I mean, it is one beautiful, beautiful place. Yes. And but that night at 7 p.m. here at the Senior Center, at, at the Orient oh. Center, oh. Uh, all three rooms are open. The whole place is open for this event. Right. Up, right? We are having at uh, starting at 7 p.m. Uh, we have a full program to recognize Veterans Day. Yep. We have a special guest speaker, uh, Brigadier General Whoa. Slocum. And, Whoa, uh, this is big yes, time, right? Big time. And uh, awesome. I've have seen the general up at Great Lakes. I've mm -hmm. seen him over and for programs over Selfridge Air Force Base. And they all, um, he's one dynamic speaker mm -hmm. and a true, true back friend. And so, mm -hmm. so he can really add to the program. Yeah. And for the public to come up and see that would be a, a pleasure to do that. That's wonderful. And not only that, and I think I hear something. Uh, unfortunately, <laughs> yes. The general's <laughs> calling. <Yeah. laughs> it's my, are they it's gonna okay. Have, I can turn off my phone. Uh, my, uh, are they going to have the 21 gun salute again up there? They had, they brought somebody in the last do. time I was here. We, our honor guard, me and Cindy are part of. Okay. Uh, we will be out there doing the honor guard. Okay. And we'll be, be playing taps. Okay, yeah, super. Yeah, so. and ON TV cameras will be there. We yep. always record record the event, yep. we share it every year, and it's it's one of those events that uh, it people tune in. They, yeah. they, huh. they watch mm -hmm. it. If you can't make it, they know it's there. Um, we've been recording, well, we've been in this facility here for 10 years now, mm -hmm. and ever since it opened, we've, we've held doing. it here. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. we've covered it uh, through thick and thin and right. pandemic <laughs> and, cool. you know, all this, all this stuff, all this stuff yeah. it always the, happens, Yeah, the right? key thing is we don't do this just for the veterans. We're doing this for the community. They yeah. can mm -hmm. learn mm -hmm. and learn Correct. what we all, what veterans are all about. Yeah. And, uh, and once again, the time of that is 7 p.m. here at the Orion Center so. um, on Joslin Road, yep. just south of Clarkston Road, the big blue building, you can't miss yep. it, right? So, yep. Awesome. Everybody come for a great time. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes, great time. and uh, and to salute those veterans mm -hmm. and uh, mm -hmm. make sure they keep them front of mind always, right? Oh, absolutely. Um, so Cindy, we got to yeah. get you involved yeah. here. Hey, so. Um, it's so mm -hmm. such a pleasure to meet you. Thank you. Um, something I'd like to share. I mean, you guys put out a great, a newsletter. wonderful Never newsletter, and, and your newsletter usually page or two. Yeah. This, this is, is amazing. It is chock full of information. It has everything you guys are doing, doing. Mm -hmm. and it has a wonderful write-up of your bio and the experiences you had. Um, I know we're here to share um, information about another event coming up, but if you want to learn more about your amazing experiences, I mean, front row to history, really? yeah. Yeah. you know, uh, yeah. do, you, do you want to share just, uh, I mean, 9-11 sure. was, kind of, I'm reading this, my jaw's on the yeah. floor going, yeah. our veterans have been front row to history. Mm -hmm. And uh, always have been, right? Some have been overseas, some mm -hmm. have been home fighting, but they are front row to history, mm -hmm. and you are no exception. Yeah, so I was uh, part of the, I'm an Air Force nurse, retired after 20 years, but I uh, joined the military in 91 mm -hmm. and um, was fortunate enough back in 1998 to become a member of the White House Medical Unit team. It's a, oh. A team of doctors Impressive. and nurses and happen? physician assistants. That's, that's I know it, it was it was not me. It was God. But anyway, <laughs> right? Um, right. Um, I was there for a purpose. But um, yes. so we're there to provide medical care for the first family, mm -hmm. uh, the president, the first family. So we did a lot of traveling with them. Yeah. Um, so I started with the Clintons, two and a half years with the Clintons, and then um, when the Bushes came in, I became their nurse mm -hmm. and uh, happened to be traveling with them, the president when he was in Florida. And, and then when 9-11 hit, that was yeah. on 9-11, and so Reading spent to the elementary next, school yeah. students, and yeah, but I was we on know. The plane Were you on the plane coming back? Air Force One, yep, I was on the plane, and right. it was just I mean, a, amazing 
it gives week, you a little months, you know, type of, it certainly did change our history, yeah. but. It, it um, Big impact. Yeah. And just, being a part of that and yeah. seeing it and having, you know, offering assistance where needed right. and right. that, that's, that's right. amazing. Yeah. Thank you so much was, for what uh, you've done. Yeah. I felt very blessed to have been able to be on the Bush administration. It was amazing. People were amazing. And yeah. Everyone. Lifetime and experiences. Is and, oh, well, and yeah. the stories you can tell around the fire, yeah. my goodness. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. We can go on and on. Yeah. I mean, but yeah, um, information about the VFW, you can find it. Your, your post is, uh, you have Facebook, just real quick. Um, Facebook, uh, you can find the page at uh, VFW334. More mm. information on mm. all of that. So, Cindy, yeah. amazing. But we're here yeah. to talk about a great event, yep. another it's, event that's happening. Yep, so we're having a, uh, a recognition for our veterans yep. at Lake Point Community Church. It's going to be the next day, so November 12th. And it's um, the second annual. And it's open to any vet, and they can bring one guest. Okay. And we're going to have a great, wonderful homemade meal with desserts and door prizes. Hey, hey, can't go wrong, right? You, entertainment awesome. and guest speakers. We have two guest speakers. One is going to be Mr. Blake Leach, and he's the COO from the Warrior Journey. So he's going to talk to us oh, about geez. that program. Okay. And then we have uh, Lieutenant Colonel Jim Miller, and he's a U.S. Army chaplain with the State of Michigan Chaplain Corps, and he's going to talk with us. But I, I really do think it's going to be an amazing event. Um, the doors are going to open at the church at uh, 4 p.m., so in the yep. foyer we're going to have a reception and appetizers from 4 to 5, and then the doors will open at 5 o'clock to go into the main dining area, and uh, dinner will begin. And is this the first this annual? Is second. Second, second, second annual. Second annual. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. we usually hear everything that's yeah. happening around yeah. town. Yeah. And yeah. this is the first time we've heard of this wonderful yeah. event. So I'm glad. I mean, timing yes. couldn't be better. That's one to come in. Why we're here. <laughs> yes, we're it's awesome. So yeah. it it having another year. event is yeah. great. Yeah. And but um, the, the key is that you yeah. have to call. Yeah. And on this flyer, oh, yeah, okay. we're going to yep. put on there that you, there's either you get a call, Bob Tim Bush. Okay. Or there's a website you can go out and sign up for. Okay, and I have that information yeah. right here. Yep. Uh, can I read yep. it? Uh, so, uh, Bob Ten uh, Babash, is that mm -hmm. how you say his name? 248 417 2451. And the website online is, uh, that's a bit. Yeah. It's a funky <laughs> website, it is, but yeah. we have a graphic on the yeah. screen presented yeah. there, so yeah. it's like bit.ly slash L-P-C-C-V-E-T. Yeah. Or, or call the church office. Or call the church yep. office. Yep. Do we have that number? Right. The, the key is you're going to call. They're gonna yes, we do. 248 yeah. is a church, mm -hmm. church number. Yeah. So right. another great event. Um, uh, for the vets to take mm -hmm. part in yeah. and make sure you call and get your tickets. Uh, do you have, I'm assuming, limited seating? Well, uh, right now we have about 200 people. We're oh, hoping wow. for 250. Wow. So that's what so. This is a big to do. Yeah. 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 Are yeah. they uh, uh, required to wear uniforms or just no. become just casual no, dress? Just casual dress. But if they want to, they do or not? Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Just they, be interested. Absolutely. They could because it's a day after Veterans yeah. Day, yeah. so they could still be still wearing their uniforms yeah. if they want it. <laughs> yeah. That'd but be nice. uh, our honor guard will be posting the colors, and uh, so we, it's going to be it's going to be a good event. Uh, sure. We have, I attended it last year, and a fantastic food yeah. served. I mean, it's all homemade food. I think so. it's homemade meatloaf. Wow. Exactly. Oh. <laughs> and this time of year, right, <laughs> yeah. the comfort food yeah. as the temperatures yeah. dip a little, yeah. not so yeah. bad, mm. right? So, so it's great food. Awesome events. Great, great people. Mm -hmm. Awesome great events. People. Mm -hmm. Awesome community service oh, nice. here with our uh, friends from the VFW. Uh, Cindy Wright and, um, and and Chuck, thank you so much for coming in. Uh, I think I got the wrap sign. I think we're getting there close is. to it. So um, thank you so much for thank coming you, in. For nice, us. fun little thank discussion yeah. here. It's always fun to have you guys in. Thanks Keep doing what you're doing. Oh. And we're big fans. And uh, I can't wait to go see the Victory Garden. And, yeah, me too. I'll stop on the way this yeah. afternoon. Yeah.